It's more than just a pretty parade through Waikiki. The Prince Kuhio Festival Parade in Ho'olaulea is educating a new generation about Hawaiian history. We welcome Antoinette Lee, Antoinette Lee uh, Prince Kuhio Festival Parade Chair, and Ray Di Koito, uh, Executive Director, Malama Local Ea Foundation. Good morning to you, both of you ladies. Good morning. Good morning. To see Aloha kakaiaka. Aloha kakaiaka. The primary purpose of the Prince Kuhio Festival Parade in Ho'olaulea really is, is more than just a parade. This That's is a, correct. really a chance to, to educate a That's lot of right. people. Yeah. To educate our people in Hawaii, the next generation, like you said, and also all the malahini that come. It's all eyes on Hawaii. It's an important guy that we celebrate, his legacy. And you know, he really hasn't been gone that long. He's only been gone 96 years. When you think about it, the scope of it, uh, again, how can people really get to know who Prince Kuhio was? Because he, like like other, our other royal uh, members of had a rich history himself that That's a lot correct. of folks don't know about well you know he was the cousin of uh, Queen Lili Okalani our last Queen mm -hmm. and so much about him that you know he of course helping his cousin through her reign being very very disappointed and on the overthrow that he got thrown in prison when the uh, overthrow of the government happened and he was in prison for a whole year you know, and being disappointed in the whole thing. So people need to know that. What's really important, though, is that he was steadfast in Onipa'a in helping her, went through prison, and then was when he was released, he was very still disappointed, left the country, and went to help the British queen. And then through, the, through our people asking him to please come home, they needed his leadership. He came home, persevered, and then became a congressman. And he became a congressman. And the after rest, all of that. After all of that. You know, Ray, when you talk about the events planned for this year, again, more than just Ho'olalea, more than just a parade, tell us about some of the other things people well, can Well, it's a month-long celebration surrounded around his birthday on March 26th, which is, as we know, a state holiday, Kuhio Day. Um, and we have many, many cultural events designed to help you know the new generation understand his legacy um, this weekend at the Royal Hawaiian Center there'll be a cultural demonstration from 1 to 5 on Sunday um, in Haleiwa Beach Park there will be a fun run and walk um, that we invite everyone to take advantage of um, we also have the upcoming parade in Ho'olalea on the uh, the following weekend and you know just lots of different activities and in inviting all of the public to come out and learn. Thank you for saying that because it's not just our visitors, but we want our come out there as well. That's correct. Absolutely. Yeah. Okay, I want to put some information on the screen again, especially for the parade happening and the festival of Ho'olaulea. Uh, it's again on March 24th, uh, 9.30 a.m., Saratoga and Kalakaua. For more information on all the events, they can go to that website, correct? Yes. yes. www.princekuhiofestival.com. And again, it has all the details of all the events, including uh, the first event at the Royal Hawaiian Center. Right. Ladies, thank you very much thank for being you. here. Thank and you. And thank you for sharing your manal. Thank Appreciate you. Appreciate it. All right, well,